I'll get you, Mario. No way. I'm not gonna win. Ha! Ha! Pshh, pshh, ha! Oh. Hello, everyone. I'm Bill Trinan from Nintendo's Treehouse. Looks like you caught me playing with my toys. When I was a kid, I used to spend a lot of time imagining who would win when my toys got into a fight. And sometimes, I still do. But wouldn't it be fun if you could actually find out? Well, pretty soon you can. You see, while these may seem like regular figures, they actually hold a secret within. We're calling them Amiibo, and we're going to create Amiibo for a variety of Nintendo characters, games, and series starting later this year. When you touch these Amiibo to the Wii U gamepad controller, you will see these characters come to life in your games in many different ways. Amiibo will expand the gameplay experience of supporting titles and bring about new types of fun and new ways to interact with your favorite Nintendo characters. But since it's probably difficult to imagine how Amiibo will expand your experience, I'd like to show you. So let me explain using the first of many upcoming Amiibo compatible games, Super Smash Bros. for Wii U, which will release this holiday alongside the first series of Amiibo. Now when I talk about figures in Smash Bros., fans of the series will probably think of this. This was the opening video from Super Smash Bros. Melee. The original concept behind this series is that figures come to life and do battle all on their own. Don't you wish you could have figures like these? Well, that wish is about to come true with Amiibo. Let's say you head over to a friend's house with a Link figure in tow. Your friend has a Wii Fit trainer figure, and luckily, Super Smash Bros. for Wii U. Each figure contains the spirit of the character they represent. So, when you touch an Amiibo to the Wii U gamepad, that character will appear in the game to do battle while you cheer it on from the sidelines, just like the original concept for the Smash Bros. series. There are many different ways to engage these characters in battle. You can pit them against other figures, you can face off against them yourself, they can team up and fight alongside you, and they may even be able to beat up your friends for you, in the game of course. Every time your amiibo battles, its abilities will get a small boost. Through battle, they can increase their overall level, along with their defense and attack powers. They can even learn tactics to become stronger opponents. In fact, through training, they can become quite formidable. Fighting against your amiibo is going to be a lot more interesting than fighting against a plain old CPU opponent. Remember, even if you and a friend both buy Link figures, they won't be the same. You can customize their special moves based on the character's unique capabilities. That means your Link amiibo becomes your personal version of Link that you can train and customize in ways that make it different from your friend's version of Link. You get to breathe new life into each figure as you watch them evolve and witness their personality take shape. This unique data will be collected and stored inside each amiibo. In this way, each amiibo is your own unique figure that can act as your alter ego, partner, or rival just by playing together. Plus, if you battle your amiibo against other amiibo, they will level up faster than against CPU or human opponents. Collect your favorite figures, then battle, train, level up, and form your own unique bond with them. Who knows, your amiibo may even be able to beat that one friend you never seem to be able to take down on your own. When we launch Super Smash Bros. for Wii U this winter, we plan to release several Super Smash Bros. amiibo as well. Now isn't this a sight to behold? And there are plans for even more characters on the way, so look forward to hearing more. And remember, Super Smash Bros. isn't the only game that will use amiibo. We also plan to make games like Mario Kart 8, Mario Party 10, Captain Toad Treasure Tracker, and Yoshi's Woolly World compatible with Amiibo. Are you wondering how each of those games will interact with Amiibo? Well, each game is different, so look forward to hearing more about them in the future. We have other plans for Amiibo too. More games and figures are in the works as I speak. And one more thing. Next year, we plan to release a peripheral that will make it so you can use Amiibo on Nintendo 3DS, too. So look forward to Nintendo 3DS games that take advantage of Amiibo as well. Combining Amiibo with our games opens up a whole range of potential new gameplay experiences. It's one of the most exciting things Nintendo is debuting at E3. 
Stay tuned for future announcements about Amiibo and the games that will use them. Thanks for watching.